So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you how to create new and creative text distortion animation without using any add-on. See guys, that's my beautiful and creative effect. Guys, it's really simple and best tutorial for beginners. So now guys, I teach you how I create this type of effect. So firstly guys, click on here. That's my new composition check. And guys, see that's my duration. Duration only 10 seconds. And take any file name and press OK. Yeah. Okay, so guys, firstly, I take text tool. So guys, select and type your letter like a creative. So guys, now I increase scale size. So guys, go to on here like a 450. And guys, alignment, alignment check. Okay, so guys, set the pivot, go to on mid. And now guys, little bit up. So guys, select and duplicate. So press Ctrl D. And guys, I take second text. So guys rename like a uh, this time animation enter and guys I change scale size so scale size change like a 300 it's good and guys same alignment check and guys go to an up and center pivot mid yes see guys that's my simple typography effect and now guys I create animation so guys select your creative text and go to on effect and presets and guys see that's my animation presets check and guys text and guys see that's my animate in that this one so guys see that's my lots of presets okay so guys now i like this one that's my ringing character so apply drag and drop and guys play yeah see guys that's my really cool effect right see okay so guys one more time play yes okay so guys i apply same effect on animation okay so guys go to zero frame and guys drag and drop apply and guys play yeah right and one more time play yes see guys that's my animation okay so guys now i change some setting on text and guys now so guys select your text and press U that's my keyframe so firstly guys select all keyframes and press F9 like this and guys see that's my one second so shift layer like this yeah right see okay so guys second one select your second layer shift layer like a four second right see guys that's my first frame I go to on one second and guys four second right Okay, so guys, now I also create opacity animation. So select and press T. That's my opacity. So opacity, guys, 0 0.15 frame. So press opacity check. And now, guys, I like 0. Yeah. That's it, guys. Right? Okay, so guys, go to back and play. Yeah. Okay, so guys, fit 200% check. Yes. So guys, preview. So guys, see, that's my preview. Yeah, see guys, that's my simple animation. And now guys, this time I apply some effect. So guys, stop. It's good. And guys, project, right click, import and import file. Guys, I have map, displacement map, so import. Yeah. So guys, this time select your text and right click precom like a text. So guys, move the attribute check and press OK. Yeah. Okay, so guys, select your displacement map, this one. So drag and drop on main com. And guys, now, so guys, hide this map, hide layer. And guys, go to on text. So guys, this time, I apply time, displacement, time. That's my displacement. And apply to on time, like this. Yes. Okay, so guys, go to on displacement, this one. So guys, change map, like this. Yeah, see guys, that's my beautiful glitch effect. So guys, now go to back and preview. Yes, see guys, that's a beautiful displacement effect. Tax distortion. So guys, one more time. Yeah, all is good. Okay, so guys, now I apply this time RGB color. So guys, select your all layer and one more time pre-com. Like a color. So guys, move all attribute check and press OK. Okay, so guys, now select your color layer. 
and guys go to our effect and this time I apply fill effect so fill and guys see that's my fill drag and drop on color yes okay so guys see that's my color so first color is red is good and guys copy and copy so guys select second one and I apply this time like a green color green yeah and guys lastly I like blue color blue yes right okay so guys now select your all layer and change mode so use screen screen check yes okay so guys one more time go to back and preview check yeah see guys that's my effect but guys see that's not colorful so little bit shift layer so stop and go to back and now guys increase spacing so guys select your second one shift layer like a five frame five and guys select third layer shift layer like a 10 frame yes and guys now preview and preview check yes see guys that's my beautiful rgb effect and guys stop so guys little bit down and fit 200 percent check and guys one more time preview preview check yeah see guys that's my beautiful glitch effect right that's really new and creative okay so guys now i apply this time animation in outer effect so guys one more time pre-com so guys like a final text and guys press ok right see guys that's my 10 second frame and now guys preview yeah that's my first effect right in and guys now go to here so guys duplicate so press ctrl d that's my second one and right click guys select your first one this one top layer and right click guys go to on time and guys see that's my reserve layer time check yes okay so guys now go to like a five second so select your this one layer shift layer like a 0 0.5 and guys see that's my out frame like this yeah see guys that's my in out effect so guys one more time go to back and guys preview check yeah right see guys that's my first effect and next one out effect yeah and now guys go to back and preview check yes see guys that's my really cool effect that's my in and now out yeah okay so guys that's it my final work is finished it's looking really good so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel and guys you can download this project file from my website it's free thank you